the scene with another banger. Yes, y'all, I am back. Um, it definitely looks like I am really short for some reason. I don't know. Like, the other day I didn't even have on, like, shoes or whatever, but for some reason it, like, just looks like I'm just, like, shorter. I do have on a shirt under here, y'all. I just can't see it, so. <sighs> Little. I'm just kidding. <laughs> no. So, y'all, uh, first of all, I broke a nail. Mm -hmm. Oh, my God. I broke a nail. Very, very upset about me breaking a nail but it's okay because i'm going to get my nails done on friday i think friday or saturday i'm not even sure um but if you guys live in georgia or the surrounding states in georgia or the surrounding states of georgia it is literally raining your girl has been sleepy all day and i literally was like oh I do not want to record, but I gotta, I gotta give y'all what you want. But I'm so sleepy, y'all. It's not even funny. But anyways, um, so yes, y'all. Um, uh, I'm wondering, literally, have you guys tried this Travis Scott burger at all? Because I'm getting mixed reviews. Like I'm getting people saying that it's just a regular McDonald's burger. Or whatever and I'm getting people saying that it's really good and then I'm getting people saying that this is disgusting worst thing I've ever tasted I don't even know what's on it let's research and see what's on it because for one you guys uh I am definitely not going to try um the Travis Scott burger just right now as you guys know I am on my weight loss journey your girl is trying to get thick thick anyways <laughs> yes your girl is trying to get thick thick um first of all i don't even know why i said that because i am already thick thick i am trying to get thick so actually i am thick 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 so i i'll settle for thick thick and i'll settle for just thick so, Bish, what? Bish, what? Bish, what? so but no i'm just playing y'all but for real i am on my um weight loss journey so i am not going to be eating this Travis Scott uh, burger because I feel like um, that's just gonna like definitely hinder what I, what I'm trying to do. And it's been day three, day three of this. My fingers look way long, way huge there. Anyways, I have huge hands as a uh, as a female. It was so easy, like, to pump a ball and all that stuff, so yeah. Okay. Anyways, y'all, but I feel like, oh, day three of this X28 stuff, so today is a rest day, so whew, thank you, because it's raining today, and liter literally, if I was to go and do a workout today, I probably wouldn't make it. I would be like, oh my goodness, because I'm so, I'm so tired. <laughs> And I have 28 days, so I have 25 more days. Um, I can do this. I know I can. It's nothing about the working out or whatever. I think my mind is just like, I have so much stuff that, you know, I keep telling you, I got so much to do. I do. I have so much stuff that I need to get done. And then working out or whatever and, you know, eating right and all of this stuff. So, your girl, you know, I need a vacation. I need a vacation and I feel like I almost fell, but I didn't. I call myself, but I definitely need a vacation um, soon. So we'll see. Just something a little cute, cute and quick. So what is on this Travis Scott burger? Because if it's just like a, if it's just a quarter pound, is this just a quarter pound with tree with trees <laughs> with cheese? Um, Travis Scott favorite McDonald's burger features a, a quarter pound of 100% fresh beef topped with onions, pickles, two slices of melty cheese, plus ketchup, mustard. Seems like a standard quarter pounder with cheese. It's also got shredded lettuce and crispy bacon because that's how Cactus Jack likes it straight up. 
So it's just a quarter pounder with cheese and add bacon. I guess. Um, I just, I'm confused, guys. Okay, let's walk through this. He did not introduce a new ingredient to McDonald's. And again, this is no hate against Travis Scott. The fact that you have a burger at McDonald's, I'm pretty sure that like deal was super lucrative and you making money so it's bread in your pocket by doing basically just eating food so the bare minimum like l literally kudos to you um but okay so back to what i was saying <sighs> okay so no new ingredients were added right like a special sauce or like he mixed honey mustard and I don't know, sweet and sour sauce together, if that's even a thing. No, no new ingredients were added to this special burger. Just stuff McDonald's already had. So McDonald's, question. If I got a burger that I like, I know I'm not as popping as Travis Scott, but if I got a burger that I like with, would you guys put it on the menu please? You, you could call it the Lola J. You just call it the Lola J. That's it. That's how you need to call it. Because I'm just like, for me, it's just like, if, if you were to put something on a menu or whatever, then at least change it up a little more than just to add bacon on something because i feel like that's you're not really doing nothing like i could have rolled up and be like hey can i get a quarter pounder with cheese and add bacon they're not gonna say no but i bet you would be a 50 cent up charge for that damn bacon or no it'd probably be two dollars for bacon i ain't ate at mcdonald's in a minute like i've eaten their morning foods but i have not eaten like actual mcdonald's like Burger, french fries, and then french fries are so good, y'all. So good. Anyways, but your girl can't even go there because, again, like I said, weight loss journey on the way. Your girl is about, I'm already fine, but just wait on it. Um, but yes, y'all. So, I just feel like if you are going to add something to a restaurant's menu or something maybe spice it up a bit like add some hot sauce or add, like add something that was not that's not already on the menu because I feel like what 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 makes me mad because I told, I told y'all the other day and I told y'all how mad I got when I when I was hungover and I just wanted me a steak egg and cheese bagel from McDonald's and when I wanted it, I, you know, pulled up, was super excited. I was like, I'm not going to be hungover anymore. Everything's going to be great. I rolled up. They didn't have it. But y'all can put a Travis Scott burger on y'all menu and take that off. something that was just like you know what that's a staple <laughs> that is gonna be a really good burger because it has this this that and, you know mcdonald's added this to the menu and this that and the third but it's okay it's all good it's all good he's still making his coin mcdonald's probably has gotten a surge in sales so good for them good for them but yes y'all so I have literally, ooh, and y'all guess what? So make sure you guys, first of all, you know, while we in the middle of this video, make sure you guys like this video, subscribe to my channel, turn that notification bell on, so you know when you girls dropping hot bangers on the scene, because y'all can do it right now while you're watching. Anyways, 
But yes, y'all, what I was going to say is that make sure you also, another request, uh, make sure you also shop at MeLola'sBeautyBar.com. Um, you can find us on Instagram, all social media accounts. Look below, all that's below. Uh, but yes, at MeLola'sBeautyBar on Instagram. But you guys, um, because I'm super excited, I have, like I told you before, I have stuff releasing in October. <sighs> You guys are gonna be like, okay, sis, you 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 better. Anyways, but yes, so I have that, and I just bought a a lip gloss machine, a lip gloss filler machine. I am so excited about it, y'all. Like, I literally, I don't, I didn't buy like the the super technical one yet because I was just like, let me just try this first. I've seen many reviews on it. And this this particular machine, I seen many reviews on it, and I seen that it was like really good. So I was just like, okay, let me just buy this one first, and let me see how this works for me. And again, like I said, y'all, I'm so excited because your girl legit is about to be pumping pumping y'all lip gloss orders out like this, like nothing. So I just like I'm I'm like super excited, like I said about it because. It's just like when you hit milestones in um, in your business and and just in life and when you're when you get to like certain points that you're like dang like just three months ago or just six months ago I was here and now look like I'm super grateful blessed and all of that to be one to be able to purchase a machine this machine and two um, to be able to supply you guys in and give back and and be able to basically you know like give y'all stuff or whatever like give y'all what you want give give the people what they want but no but for real though like just be able to you know honestly just have a, another stream of income for myself and to be able to teach other people in my generation and the younger generation on what it's like to build a business and all of that stuff so I have a long journey and a long way to go I'm definitely not where I want to be um, but I mean not like I, I'm not there yet where I want to be so I got you know a, a little bit to go but I'm getting there y'all I am getting there I'm telling you multi-billion dollar company manifested like every time you wake up in the morning make sure that you're working and you're manifesting you're praying and and you're like working to get to where you want to go like literally you do not have to sit here and just like look at everything you got going on in life and just just struggle through it you don't have to do that so there's always like you know things are always temporary and make sure that you're always setting yourself up building blocks and stuff and especially if you got kids create generational wealth like that is extremely important but just like do something each day that gets you to the point where one if you don't want to work for a corporate company anymore do something each day that'll get you a, a step closer to you saying all right y'all it was cute <laughs> okay but get like do something each and every day like no days off don't slag do what you gotta do like literally i did not want to record today i was tired is that raining right now but it was raining it was pouring earlier i got emails blowing up for my work or whatever then i posted a video today on instagram um no i posted on youtube today so i'm like going through that trying to promote that then i have this stuff to do like and then i have to record so it's just like if i would have just said no i'm not going to record today to me that literally probably it would have hurt my heart and I know it would hurt y'all's heart too, cause y'all would have you miss you would have missed your girl. But no, but it's <laughs> but it's more so. It's just like I know that I would have been so disappointed in myself because I've been like, you could have recorded this video, edited, it, and cause I love editing, y'all. Like it's so much fun, um, and I love recording too. But it's just more so of a mindset thing because. This stuff, like all of this, I'm not used to doing. Like literally, I'm used to like going to work, coming home, looking at Netflix, doing, you know, just like I have not watched Netflix. 
I just finished Gotham, but Gotham I could have I played in the background while I was doing stuff, but I really haven't watched Netflix because I've just been so busy doing other stuff. So I just feel like you know, you just you want to be consistent and do something every single day to help you get to where you want to go. If your goal is to say, hey, like I want to I want to be the vice president of this company that I currently work for, then what are you doing each and every day to get yourself there? Like, no, everybody does not have to have a business. Everybody does not have to want to branch out and be a YouTuber, be an influencer and stuff like that. So whatever, like, your main goal or what you feel like your purpose is in life, if you're not consistently contributing your time and effort towards that, you're never going to get there. You're just, it's, things just, like, you can't just expect things to just get thrown into your lap and, and okay, here you go. Now, what are you going to do? So this world, you have all the tools and resources to be as, as, as rich as you want, as, as, like influence like you just have all the tools y'all is basically what i'm trying to say um so yeah y'all uh literally so yes i'm excited about this <laughs> y'all know I, I get i get going when i start talking about like business y'all i get so excited and then i want to tell y'all just to be consistent and stay on it because when i tell y'all that too like i'm telling myself too because i feel like if I'm saying it to y'all, then how can I not do it if I'm saying it to y'all? You know what I'm saying? Because I feel like that is just like, sis, like, get out of here. <laughs> like, you, you not even doing it. And the same thing, like, with the weight loss thing, too. Like, if I literally say, okay, y'all, like, I'm working out. I want you guys to work out, too. Let's do this workout. And then I start putting out workout clothes. And then I start, you know, having workout, like, a gym and stuff like that. I can't convince you guys to that this is, like, good business for you to invest in if I'm not doing what I got to do on my end. So, yes, y'all, like, I'm trying to hold y'all accountable, and I thank you for all my supporters that are holding me accountable as well, because your girl is on it. But, yes, y'all, so I'm excited about that machine that I got, and then I'm also going to order the other stuff this weekend. Um... Yeah, I'm going to order the other stuff that I am adding on to me, Lola's Beauty Bar. I'm ordering that, and uh, yeah, so this weekend, and then also, I will tell y'all that, I don't know what that was, <laughs> I will tell y'all that I am releasing new colors, I'm excited, I don't know how many new colors yet, um, I'm thinking maybe four, might be five, not sure, but I will definitely have clips in here on the new colors that I release when it's time to release as long as well as with everything else that um, I'm releasing and y'all just please you know shop with your girl that not even like I have I just I'm super excited like you know about the the journey that I'm on and things that I'm doing or whatever and I just want y'all to be excited ex inspired and all of that stuff as well with me so any suggestions or if you guys also yes y'all if you do want me to try any of your merch or do like you know or promote you shout you out i'm always down for that um because you know it takes one person for you to come across and it literally one person one like one click one share all of that for you to legit get uh get where you want to go or a step closer so i am down to cross share cross collab uh products or whatever with each other so we can definitely do that um but yeah just send uh send me the products to my p.o boxes down below so yeah just send it to me and you know if we if i'll reach out to you if you want to do a cross collab you can email me um or hit me up on instagram that'll be fine too but yes y'all it is your girl lola j and i will see y'all when i see you hopefully i get this nail fixed <laughs> 
Hey y'all, it is your girl Lola J and yes, I am the owner of Me Lola's Beauty Bar and I am showing you right now a color called Reckless. Yes, anytime you feel like you want to be a little reckless, you know, we all sitting in the house, you know what, just chilling and making sure we don't catch this corona. So I just feel like right now you may feel like you want to be a little reckless, take, take some cute cute pictures go ahead and shop with your girl and get reckless by me lola's beauty bar now we have closures we have wigs we have frontals we have bundles and we got more accessories and clothing coming soon and on top of that we have bomb lip gloss colors so yes y'all make sure y'all shop with your girl okay bye